Hi, my name is um, Lisa Martin, and I'm recording my vlog assessment for my vlog assignment um, for the last lecture. I'm going to start with um, some of the life lessons that he provided in the video. Um, the first one is, when you are screwing up and no one says anything to you anymore, that means they gave up on you. Well, to me, that means that people or someone doesn't believe in you anymore. Um, I personally think that if you see someone struggling, you should help them out because you would want them to help you. Um, you don't know what one's going through in life, so everyone deserves a chance to be helped. Um, the second one is when you do the right thing, good stuff has a way of happening. Well, I kind of relate to that situation right now due to a coworker at work kind of picking fights at me. I was something she sees me doing, but I'm not doing. Um, but anyways, we had a little altercation about it and I confronted her and told her I didn't agree with what she was saying. Um, so I feel that was the right thing to do, but, um, apparently not in her eyes. So, um, maybe something good will come out of it and everything will work itself out. Um, the third is the brick walls are there for a reason. They are there to give us a chance to show how badly we want something. Now this one, I've hit many brick walls in my life. Um, I worked as LPN for 11 years, finally decided to go back to school. Well, my first brick wall was ACT test. Took several attempts, but I finally got what I needed. Finally get accepted into the program. Well, hit another wall. I failed out of the um, first class in the program. So, set out. I finally get accepted. But anyways, what I learned from this is it don't matter how many um, brick walls you hit, you can get through it and you can get past those walls. Because I am now an RN of um, two years. And... I'm glad I stuck it out and finally achieved one of my dreams, and that was to become a registered nurse. Um, the fourth is don't complain, just work harder. Well, kind of goes hand in hand with the brick wall. Of course, I complained the whole time, you know, that I was failing, but it also, um, I worked a lot harder. So complaining don't get you nowhere. It just wastes your time. But I worked harder and finally achieved it. So it may not happen when you want it to happen, but it will eventually if you stick to it and you work hard to get there. Um, five, when people give you feedback, cherish it, cherish it and use it. Um, Feedback is actually something great. Um, it don't matter if it's negative, positive. You need to take that feedback and use it to do something good. Use it to better yourself. And don't think that they're giving you feedback as something negative because it's not always negative. It may be there to help you do better in what you're doing. Um... Six, you can't get there alone. Um, that is very much true. Like, if it hadn't have been for my friends and family um, to help me through my problems, I would have never made it. Um, so, if you see someone struggling and they're alone, be there for them. Because when you have something going on in life, being alone is not something that you need. You need, you need someone there to help you. Um, wait long enough and people will surprise you, will surprise and impress you. When you're pissed off and you're angry at them, you just haven't given them enough time. Um, some people just need a little more time in order to impress you. you 
like your first impression of someone is not always accurate. Um, just like a friend of mine, a real good friend of mine, her first impression of me was she didn't think I was very nice. But now she's one of my best friends and she just went by, you know, her first impression, which wasn't very accurate. So give people time and they'll surprise you at how they really are. Um, don't bail. The best gold is at the bottom of the barrel of crap. Um, sometimes you have to go through a lot of crap to get where you need to be. Um, I've gone through a lot of crap to get where I'm at. So just help others get past the bad and help them to get to the good in their life. Okay. Some of the advice that Randy gives and important words to live by. I just took notes um, as I was watching the video, so they're probably not in order, but um, and I may have mentioned more than what the assignment calls for. So it is um, be good at something. It makes you valuable. Find the best in everybody. No matter how you have, <clears throat> no matter how you have to wait for them to show it, be prepared. Luck is where preparation meets opportunity. It is not about how you achieve your dreams; it's about how you lead your life. Tell the truth. Apologize when you screw up. Focus on others, not yourself. Show gratitude. Always show gratitude. Um, loyalty is a two-way street. Never give up and help others. So, we cannot change the cards we are dealt, just how we play the hand. Um, so you wanted an example of a tough hand. So, I'll try to get through this um, without crying, but one of the tough hands in life I had to deal with was my brother. He committed suicide. Um, so, how it happened, um, I'm not going to tell all the details, but I was on the phone with my mother one day. Well, my mom and my stepdad was at his house, standing outside his house, because he was having some troubles. Well, they were going to go try to help him. Well, as I was on the phone with my mom... I hear this loud pop. Well, he shot himself. Um, so after that, while I was at work, um, I had someone come get me and went to the hospital. Um, and in that situation, you just have to be there for everybody, you know be there for your family. Um, try to comfort them. There's really no comfort, not much comfort for suicide. Um, but you do the best you can. So we all had our chance to um, say our goodbyes while he was in the hospital, of course. Um, he had two boys, or he has two boys. Um, and today it's, it's still very hard to deal with. So, I mean, we're still dealing with this hand on a daily basis. Um, like the holidays, you know, 4th of July, that was his favorite holiday. So I always mention and remember the 4th of July in his honor because he loved it. Like all the fireworks and stuff. But... Um, yeah, I feel I played that hand pretty good. Like, you just have to be there for, for your family and help try to comfort the best you can. Um, what I learned from this video is life is not always easy and things may not go as planned, but don't ever give up. Um, you may not achieve the dream you want in the time frame that you want, but 
you'll get there. It'll happen. Um, if not, something better may come along. Um, Randy, it was a great video, by the way. I loved it. Um, he gave great advice, great life lessons, great words to live by. Um, I'll try to use these on a day-to-day -day basis to help me become a better person and to help me succeed in my career. Um, but I really enjoyed the video. Like, he, he was very inspiring, especially all of his dreams he wanted. Um, he got, he achieved everything that he wanted. So, don't give up. You'll get there. Anyways, hope I didn't just ramble on, drive you crazy. Sorry I look like poo, but I'm sitting here doing homework all day. Anyways, have a great day. Thanks.